Hello everybody, PJ here for Intense Computing, and today I'll be talking about the application named Transmission. It's currently, me, currently only for Mac um, and other Unix distros, but not for Windows. It is free, and it's a great alternative to keyboards. And if you want to see third-party websites to download your torrent files, then it's a great alternative to you. I did show off these in my last video, so click here if you want to see um, my last video about this compared to YouTube. Um, so once you go to the transmission website, the main page will be like this, and then you can actually click on the download section, and it shows you that they have it's available for Mac OS X and these units, which is a lot. So. Obviously, the very Windows makes this um, not out for Windows. So, um, let's dive right into the transmission app itself. Once you install it, it's going to look something like this, and you're going to have the options. Once you get, let's just uh, uh, I have already got the Pirate Bay tab open, and let's go ahead and get the Skype beta. Now, of course, this is a PC. Don't you worry won. about it. I'm on a Mac. I'm just showing this as an example. So once this downloads, I'm just clicking Show on Finder. Right click, Open with, and then click on the Transmission app. And then I'm going to go ahead and add to the transmission. Now, this is going to uh, be a little bit faster than Views, and possibly, most likely, a little bit faster than Utorrent. Depending on the app, uh, the thing that you're downloading, it might be faster for either application. Again, this is two minutes that it's going to take, so that's pretty quick for a torrent file. That's not really used by many people. It only has 10 seeds on it. So, um, definitely suggest this program. It also allows you to change uh, your download and upload speed, so you can set your up to upload speed to something real, real slow so that people can't torrent off you and then set your upload or your download speed to something real real high and then that way uh, you you get the you're torrenting something faster than people are downloading it from you definitely suggest this one thing that I do suggest is once you're done with it uh, closing out of it right clicking and closing out of it um, and another cool little feature that I forgot to tell you is it actually tells you your speed right down here um, while your download is going on so that's definitely cool so you, you know you, you don't have to go back to your application every single time uh, let's say you had a, a something over top of it you can just go right down here and not have to worry about going into it so definitely cool feature um, and definitely a cool application definitely suggest this one and until next time best tech best talk